Hello, my name is Kastudis and today we will learn how to check your WordPress error logs. If your WordPress website has run into a critical error, checking the error logs is the go-to way of getting it all sorted out. This process is not at all complicated and here's how you can do it. We began by navigating to your website's files. This can either be done via an FTP client or if you're using HPanel, the super handy file manager. Here we open the wp-config.php file. Scrolling down for a bit, you will find a line that says, that's all, stop editing, happy publishing. Here's where we will be adding the lines of code that will enable WordPress error logging for your website. For your convenience, all of these lines of code will be available in the description. The first line to enter is define wp underscore debug true. Your WordPress config file might already have this line present. If so, make sure it says true instead of false. This line enables WordPress debug mode. The second line is define wp underscore debug underscore log true. This enables error logging. And lastly, define wp underscore debug underscore display false. What this option does is changes whether the error your WordPress website is encountering is visible on the website itself. It's recommended to have this set to false, as having anyone who visits your website be able to see all the issues present on it makes your website more vulnerable to hacking. Now, if someone visits your website and it encounters an error, you will be able to see that in the error log file. You can find this file by navigating to your website's wp-content directory. What you're looking for here is the debug.log file. Opening it up, you'll be able to see a timestamp on when the error was encountered, as well as more information about the error itself. Were you able to sort your error out? Maybe you need some help? Let me know in the comments below. If you found this video helpful, drop a like and subscribe to Hostinger Academy for more awesome tutorials like this one. Until then, I wish you best of luck in your online journey.